so moving on to brows i have four different brow gels i have um the w7 queen of brows um and this is a brow mascara and i really like the wand on this focus then i have two gimme brows i oh <laughs> i have one in shade one and one in shade three oh and then i have rimmel london brow this way brow styling gel and it just looks like this Ooh. and i'm not this color isn't great and i'm not too sure on the wand because it is very big for my small brows and it can be very easy to mess up then i have the myx tame and frame tinted brow pomade then i have my precisely my brow by benefit and this is in shade two and this is amazing i love it and then i also have browsings in shade two which is a taming and shaping kit by benefit i also have this brow kit by barry m and this is shape and just fine light to medium barry m and it just looks like this inside you've got your wax your brow powder and then a, like a highlighter kind of thing okay so next moving on to eyeshadow the anastasia Bev um, is it Anasta anastasia Anas anastasia i'm not sure however you want to pronounce it modern renaissance um beverly hills palette and this is my favorite it's so soft it's a velvet and then this is like really heavy like this is a heavy like this is my heaviest palette like all my drugstore ones are so much lighter than this and i have kind of made this a very messy palette but i use it so much and it's like my favorite and i'm actually very surprised i haven't hit pan on this yet because i use it all the time so then i also have my dupe for the modern renaissance palette which is up by it's delicious by w7 and it is very very similar then i have another w7 palette which is beat it and basically looks like this inside then i have in the nude by w7 and i have had this i think this is my first ever eyeshadow palette and i picked pan on a shade then i have the revolution redemption palette in iconic free if i can open it it looks like that and then i have the revolution um soap palette which is her first palette and the shades in this are just divine then i have the blushed nudes eyeshadow palette by maybelline and it just looks like this on the inside then i have a 17 eyeshadow palette which basically looks like this on the inside then i also have the revaholic eyes palette and this is so 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 pretty this is filled with sparkles mattes browns golds pinks it's just so nice then I have, this is kind of, I got it on Amazon I think, and this is kind of like a Kylie dupe palette, I think. I mean it looks pretty much the same but it's like a dupe, it doesn't actually say Kylie on it but yeah and it's very similar shades to one of their palettes. I'm not sure which one but this one's just called V Bronze palette so who knows but I'm pretty sure it's like a dupe. Next I've got Revolution Flawless Matte Palette and then I have the Revolution Mermaid Forever Ultra Eyeshadow Palette and then the shades are there. And then I also have the, I've, I still got it in the box, I don't know why, but I've got the Morphe 35B Eyeshadow Palette. I have also got the Morphe 35T. Um, then I have this is an eyeshadow and this is a wet and wild um, it's like a it's like a glitter eyeshadow and it's super pretty and it's in the shade brass and I don't want to press too hard because I don't want to use it all up but it basically it basically comes out as like actual glitter 
and this is gorgeous and then I have collection glam crystals liquid eyeshadow which looks like this okay so now moving on to mascaras I have a W7 Crystal Clear Clear Conditioner Mascara and this is just a clear one to add a bit of length and I also use it to set my brows in place sometimes. Then I have the, this is a mini, um, this is a mini one and this is a Benefit Bad Girl Bang and I can honestly hands down say it is worth the money. It's amazing, it doesn't clump and it gives your lashes so much volume. I've got the Miss Sporty Studio Lash V Meow Look Mascara got the absolutely waterproof mascara by w7 and i was a little bit disappointed with this i thought it was gonna be well it says waterproof and it should be waterproof but it wasn't really waterproof i wore it and it all smudged and come off when i went in the water so w7 let me down on this one so i have this double wear mascara by estee lauder and this is just a mini one that my mum gave me and these have such nice ones and finally it is lips and honestly I have so many lip products I have loads of baby lips here and I think I have about 16 baby lips in total which I really like I have oh, the beauty blender in there but I have all these lip things okay you're on a tripod right now okay so then finally we have um, we have lips, so I've got all of these Dr. Paw Paw lip oils, and these are all in different shades. We've got red, light red, sparkly red. Sexy Mother Pucker um, lip gloss by Soap and Glory, and I have also got oh, nearly dropped it two revolution lip glosses that i got in my revolution advent calendar last year i also have a whole bag full of more like my whole calendar I felt like all these highlighters bronzers everything i got in the calendar but i put them all in like a sandwich bag and i can't really find where i put them and i can't bother to go through all my boxes to find them so yeah <laughs> i have quite a few lips i've got this it's like a mauvey kind of nude color I've got a slightly lighter nude. Then I've got this bright pink, which is very bright and I don't wear it that often. I've also got more of a coral orangey pink shade, which is really pretty. And then these are my two favourite colours. This colour, which is definitely going to be coming out this autumn. I'm going to be wearing this so, so much and I've also got a red. Shall I put some of this on now? I'm feeling it, I'm feeling it with this top, I think it's going to look nice. I'm going to co put some of that on. Okay, so I'm back and I've just put some of this on and I'm feeling it. I like it. Got this free set of Soap and Glory gloss sticks and they're just in purple, nude and pink. Then I've got this, all the writing scratched off back, this is from Primark and this is just a P.S lipstick and if i remember rightly this is in the shade bombshell which is really pretty these two um lipsticks and i don't think these are actually like got a proper brand but these just came in like a set thing and these are super pretty like the shades and they come out really well like they they're really good and they're really creamy and nice and yes i think that is oh i just realized my light's on Okay, so that is everything I have in my makeup collection and I am 13 years old so I guess you could say this is my makeup collection at 13 and I probably don't use all of it as much as I should. None of it gets used very often and I probably should try and use it a lot more but that is everything that I've got to say. I really, really hope you enjoyed this video please comment down below any video suggestions ideas anything like that that you may have and i would just like to say thank you so 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 much for watching this video please give it a big like subscribe and comment down below and i hope you're all having a great day and yeah love you all bye Mwah.